Well, hello everyone. Welcome to my first ever YouTube talking video. Welcome to I Just Love Cars. This is my brand new channel and I've always wanted to do this channel but just I just never had the guts. Just It was never the right time to do it. So I thought I'm gonna start doing today because I am taking this beauty today to get the wheels refurbished. So let me show you around. When I first got the car, the whole interior was just shot. The dials right here, they were not working. The whole steering wheel was just really, really old looking. I mean, it was old, treads were coming out. So I bought this, literally almost a brand new steering wheel. Changed all of those dashes right here at the front. Changed a lot of things from her actually. Made her better. She had a massive exhaust and I really didn't like it. So what I've done now, I just actually changed to the facelift exhaust as you can see. I just need to put better rubber mounts on it because it's not really sitting nice. And today we are going to take her to a body shop. And when I say why, she looks nice. Well, she does look nice, but however, the wheels, they're pretty scratched up. So we're taken to the company called Scuff and Scratch Solutions in Milton Keynes, as you can see. So I'm thinking to get them done maybe in either gunmetal gray or maybe even just a normal silver. So I'm not too sure yet. So let's quickly go through all the wheels. So this is the rear one, as you can see, it's pretty badly scuffed up. This one's really, really bad. It's just basically kind of corroded, you know, because it's diamond cut and I like the diamond cut wheels, but gosh, did they corrode quickly. This one's not too bad actually, but still obviously it's best if we do do it. And I just showed you that one before, this rear really one. So I'm, uh, I'm making my way now to the um, Scuff and Scratch Solutions in Milton Keynes. As is my first video, I'm kind of actually shaking by doing it. Um, I will ask the guys if they're okay with me to like film it in there, if we can do anything about it at all. So um, I shall catch you in a minute at um, Scuff and Scratch Solution Solutions. Let's start her up. It's crazy to believe that an 18 year old car with 136,000 miles just drives, does everything what you want it to do. I got air conditioning refilled, works like a dream. I mean, I just love this car. I will show you what other cars I got later in the videos, but this car for me is just, it's the most fun car to drive. Guys, here we are. Where are we? <laughs> Scuff and Scratch Solutions. Yeah, okay. That's the one. What we're gonna do? So, what color we're gonna do on these on uh, on this car? I would personally do an anthracite gunmetal gray. It's your car, so. That's what I'm thinking as well. I don't want something silver because silver just looks very cheap, doesn't it? You know. So we're gonna go with anthracite gray, and we'll get back to you guys when it's all done. When's it gonna be done? End of play today, might go into tomorrow, but we'll try, I'll just have them done for the same day for you. So if you're in the Milton Keynes area, come around here, this guy will sort you out. So they do really nice cars, there's a lot of Honda Civics, I mean they do, so yeah, come around and see them. So this is Rob anyway. Nice to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I decided I'm going to do anthracite colour on it. Apparently red and dark is going to look nice. This is the colour that they're going to do, which is on this van, which is pretty actually nice. What do you guys reckon? Leave the comments below. Well, a very, very good morning and welcome back to the channel. I just love cars. 
Today is the second day and we already picked up the Honda S2000. Now from yesterday's video you've seen that I was kind of going to go over the anthracite grey but after doing some researching and Google and everything like to see what this car would look in anthracite grey color I've actually went against everything that I said and I've decided to go with this color. Let me show, show you around. So after some careful consideration I've decided to go with what's just called Deutsch Silver. It's a very bright, lovely silver. I personally think it looks better. It just looks original. At one point I was even going to call them up and saying, can you do in white? Now they said that the wheels were very, very corroded and I'm, I'm very happy the way it came out. Very happy the way they came out. Let me show you on the other side. Again, very nice. It just looks so original at the moment, you know? Leave a comment below what you guys think. Right choice or not? Don't forget, this car will be up for sale. Therefore, I just want it to be as original as possible. What I'm going to do, I'm going to paint these nasty calipers. Now, here she is. Looking way, way better than she did before. Wow, I'm actually quite stoked. So a big, big thanks, big shout out to Scuff and Scratch Solutions in Milton Keynes. They the one that done this job. It's a very, very quick turnaround. Obviously they're not done like fully properly. They didn't dip it in acid. They didn't do that. It's, you know, it's a quick job, but I think it just looks way better than it did before. So here we go. Thanks a lot guys for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe. Click that notification bell because I will be doing some obviously new videos um, in the next couple of days. I won't be doing, I won't be vlogging each day. I don't think I have anything that much to say, you know. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to, next couple of days I'm going to make another video or probably doing some other things to this car because I'd like to tea cut the whole car, just, you know, bring the color back nicely. So that's about it. Thank you very much. Please subscribe, click the notification bell, click the like if you don't mind it. Let's get to the first thousand followers in the next couple months, you know, or even in the first month. Let's try to do that. That'd be amazing. Thank you very much and speak to you soon. Ciao. No, I can't say ciao because the other YouTuber says ciao. So what I'm going to say is see you later.